everyone very good evening mc tamilrasan here from chennai event mc chennai event entertainers and chennai event professionals event mc mc trainer mc manager and the founder of the above brand so uh, this is a live where i am going to educate the fellow mcs especially the freshers who have just stepped into event industry or we have done just one or two events so i am going to help them build their mc profile because when i am expanding my services across india so i have been in talk with lot of the mcs in other states especially pune mumbai delhi and kolkata and the feedback what i got from some of the mcs is that they have just started their mc career they have done one event or two events or they are just uh, going as trainee with others so they didn't have profile at all one important thing uh, what we need as an mc manager or a fellow mc or an event manager to uh, uh, push an mc's profile is that is to push an mc for an event is their profile so always it's very important to have a profile for an mc even if they are a fresher or if they have done one or two events so that's what i'm going to guide you how to create it because uh, creating a profile is the biggest task i would say for an mc more than hosting an event because a lot of mcs they think that it's too technical uh, it's not my cup of tea how to create a profile so they always depend on a designer or a developer or whatever the terminology is you see they say that i'm looking out for my friend who is going to design my um, profile uh, or whether it's a pdf or a ppt but i have explained in several other videos how to create a profile in a simple way to start with a ppt or in a microsoft word or a publisher and later when you want to have it a very professional profile you can definitely take the help of an uh, take the help of a professional or a designer who can design your uh, profile but in the beginning you can do it by yourself okay now the next question comes i have never done an event or uh, i've done just one event how can i build a profile so my answer would be even if you have done just a single event you can put it in your profile as i said in the beginning creating a profile is uh, difficult but updating a profile is very easy so as soon as you have completed one event immediately create your profile because the basic details that are to be in a profile or i have explained in several videos here i'm going to just uh, run through uh, in a, a quick way so first thing would be your first page would be showing that you are an mc with a mic or without mic there can be a picture of yours saying that mc tamilarasan or if you have any other names or names or short names you can mention that you can mention it as mc portfolio tamilarasan and your picture that would be a first page so for this it's not mandatory you should have done an event or you should have a mic you can even put a portfolio picture or which you have clicked in your mobile this is the first page second thing what is the reason you are getting into this event industry or what is the reason why you are into emcing what is the reason you are into emcing you can say that uh, i like to talk to people i like to explore i always love to be with people i like to be with kids so what are the reason why you are into event industry or emcing so you can mention that that's going to be the second page so for this thing uh, it's not mandatory you should have hosted an event for every page what i'm going to explain you now it's not mandatory you should have a prior experience it's everything based on your character based on your passion so the second page is who who you are and why you are into emceeing third page would be what are the uh, genres or what are the field or what are the types of event you like to host for example you can say i like to host birthday parties or i like to host corporate events or i like to host small activities so based on your experience like whatever you have seen or wherever you are getting trained so because when you want to get into emceeing there should be two things one Uh, you train yourself by seeing youtube videos or seeing other events when you go as a promoter seeing other mcs second thing you get trained by other event professionals like mcs event managers or any event uh, mc in training institute so these are the two ways you become an mc so based on your experience there whether uh, irrespective of that you have not hosted an event but you have you would have seen the events uh, prior to your uh, first event so you you would have a little bit of understanding that what sort of event you are comfortable which you can do so you can mention that these are the events i'd like to explore and then you can add your portfolio pictures like which which i have been shot in dslr uh, camera or whether it can, it can be in a mobile also you are going to have some four to eight or maybe some more pictures like uh, covering two or three slides and then the next slide would be your contact information like how we can contact your phone number your facebook page facebook profile email address all these things and then a gratitude column expressing your gratitude to whoever has been an inspiration for you or whoever has taught you emceeing or uh, the uh, event related things so these are the basic structure of your profile which you can create it as soon as you decide you want to get into emceeing and then as you host uh, events immediately you can just add one slide for example let me say if you are a fresher you are uh, hearing this live for the first time or uh, if no one has guided you in the uh, before uh, this is what you are going to do right now or today tomorrow you what you are going to do take a ppt create a first page with your photo uh, saying mc whatever your name and then mc portfolio your name second page would be you are going to explain about you who you are what's your qualification why you are into emceeing you are going to do that third thing you are going to write what are the areas you would like to explore birthday party corporate event or whatever fourth page you are going to add your photos fifth page you are going to add your contact information 
sixth page is going to be a graduate column. That's it. Six page PPT is ready for you now. It may take one to two hours because as I said at uh, the beginning and as I have been keep on saying, creating the first profile is the toughest task. But after that, updating is very easy. So initially, you'll be spending one to two hours to create this basic outline. And then once your profile is ready, some you'll be trying to, but I have explained in other videos also. I'll let me touch it uh, slightly here. You can go as a trainee with other MCs. You can go as a co-host with other MCs. You can create some opportunities like approaching your school, tutorials, orphanages, old age homes. You can ask them. I will do some events for you for free so that you get photos and videos there. As soon as you get the photos, immediately you are going to create one additional slide here where you are going to add it. After your portfolio, you'll have another slide called as my events. So you can add that photos there and you can add one more slide saying that my experience in events, what are the events I have hosted. So you'll add one event, I have hosted NGO event and you'll be adding corresponding slide. And then once you do your second event, say you have hosted a birthday party, then in your events column, you'll be adding the second event as a birthday party and you'll add one more slide for birthday party. So adding the slides and adding your event um, name, event genre is pretty easy. It's going to take hardly five to 10 minutes. As I said earlier, and as I've been keep saying again and again, creating the first profile is a difficult task. The reason why I'm insisting it again and again is I've seen people who are one year experience, two years of experience, still not created a profile, thinking it's something uh, very expensive or something to take in. That's the reason I'm saying creating first profile is easy if you sit uh, to do that. Rather, if you keep on postponing it, it's going to be one of the toughest tasks. So start creating your profile right away. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me on my mobile number. 9003087198. You can also email me at chenneyeventprofessionals.com. Also, if you are an MC, experienced MC, or if you are just creating a profile after seeing my video, please create your profile and email it to me and also let me know that you have created that. So that will be a motivating factor for me and I will know that how many people have got benefited out of it. And then I'll be able to guide you further based on that profile, what the correction can be done and what sort of next level profile can be created and how you can market this profile because uh, after creating the profile, you need to market it. You need to send it to your event manager. You need to put it online in few portals. So I'll be guiding you. What are the ways you can um, market your profile? That's it for now. Thank you so much for watching this live. I'm Sita Marasan signing off from Chennai Event MCs, entertainers and professionals. Please do visit our website, chennaieventprofessionals.com and also like our Facebook page, Chennai Event Professionals. Thank you.